Right guys, so this is a warning, Mullumbimby is about to go under. Lismore is probably already under and I'll show you why. I'll tell you why, it's very simple. You have up here, you have something off the coast here. It's minus 60 degrees, okay? They're using something to lower the temperature to push this cold down. Then they're releasing particles here and that's pushing down into northern New South Wales. And then they have the radar Doppler systems from Moree, okay, as a Grafton one as well, which is pushing up. That's why we have these straight lines across here, straight lines, Moree, straight line, pushing the system, holding it in there, creating the cold, okay? This is the cold front. It's coming down here being intensified iron oxide or whatever they're using. They're using something different. I've never seen this before, guys. I've been looking at the skies for 10 years. Look at my YouTube. 10 years I've been doing geoengineering. This is new. This is not the planes spraying and, spraying and geoengineering. This is something else. It's possibly Navy ships off the coast. Okay, and they're releasing something. And it's coming down here. Now, this has been here for four to five hours. I've been watching it for the last four to five hours. Okay, watching this stay here, that stay here, it's the perfect storm. Okay, and we're actually running out of uh, internet because there's so much rain going on. Mullumbimby is about to go under, guys, so you need to start evacuating. And you can see the frequencies coming up here. The frequencies here, look, zip, 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 there it is. The frequencies over here. This whole section could be getting hit with harp. We don't know. It could be from Alaska. could be hitting us from here. Okay. Then we have the smaller systems. How has a storm got straight edges? And it's even spewing out the top here. It's being squashed here from Moree. This is where the Moree system is, and I'll show you. Okay. I'll show you a photo from not long ago. There we go. Moree. That's the system. Okay. Blasting in. Blasting in. Pushing out the top. It's coming down from here. This is heavy fucking rain all the way through here. And it's being intensified up here, coming down, and they're holding it in this area to fuck up the northern New South Wales because this is the most woke area in Australia, and they're doing it on purpose. Now, I'll show you. This is infrared, okay? I have a program, infrared. This is the border, okay? They're releasing something here. That is freezing fucking cold. That is freezing cold. That is cold. That is cold. Minus 60. Look at the temperature. Minus 20, 30, 40. Minus 60. Minus 60 degrees. It's there, there. And then minus 50 here, here. It's bringing the cold front down. This is weather warfare, guys. This is the cold coming off the back. And then it's sweeping down here, getting hit with the radar system, pushed into the northern New South Wales, and it's destroying our community. And that is the plan. And this is the map many, many hours ago, four hours ago, same thing, being hit. Okay? Here's the system coming down. Here's the cold shit up here, working its way down, coming in. Okay? Hours ago. Hours and hours ago. And there's only a couple of hours ago. Here, boom, straight lines. Three to four hours. It's been like this. Being hit from the side. Could be a boat out here. Could be a radar system. Could be another Navy boat. I'm pretty sure this is Navy. Okay, it's not geoengineering the normal planes flying around. It's a form of cloud seeding where they're letting something. It's releasing something. It's coming out. It's trickling down. And they're using a natural storm to bring it down, push it in, hold the bottom, push it in, hold it there. Absolute weather modification manipulation. Now I'll show you the fucking map again. There we go. Oh, that's very natural, Nate. Yes, it's a new cloud called uh, Straight Line Cloud, and uh, we're going to make an uh, announcement on the news. It's part of a new thing called a rain bomb. Yeah, it's a rain bomb, and it's coming for you. Fucking bastards they are, these New World Order fucking bastards. Look at it. Check it out. Look at it. Okay, it's infrared. My mate has a system of infrared showing it. Look at it. Minus fucking 60 degrees. Why? One, two, three, and four off the coast. That could be on the coast. It's right on the edge, okay? One, two, three, possibly Navy ships releasing something. There it goes, coming down, making its way back in, then being intensified by all of the Doppler, Harp, 
and next trade facilities that are around Australia. Now, now we're back to the live map. Here we go. Look, look at the frequencies. You don't see them on the photos. It's hard to see because it's being pumped here, hitting it, hitting it, hitting it. Still straight. Why do we still have a fucking straight storm for? Okay, it's blasting out the top. It's being hit there. It's blasting out. Look at it. That's the minus sixties up here, right? Doesn't look very natural, does it? What's going on there? Why is it raining out there in the middle of the ocean? In this one spot, just above the coast, so I can come down here and be intensified, just off the coast of Maroochydore. Okay, they've got systems in, in Brisbane. It's being hit, it's being intensified all through here, and it's being held in like a nice tight container for where? Grafton, Yamba, Ballina, Byron, Tweed, Lismore, Mwilumba. The wokest area in Australia. That is the woke capital of people who hate the system, hate the council, hate the government, don't want anything to do with the wars. And that's because we breezed through COVID. We laughed at COVID because it was a fucking joke and we all knew it. And I said to my mate on a podcast a year and a half ago, I said to him, I wonder what surprise they have installed for northern New South Wales, seeing we absolutely blitz through COVID. Look at the frequencies coming here. Look at them coming in. Look at it. Look at it. Still straight line there. Since when do you have straight lines in storms? You don't. Okay, it's intensified. It's artificial. I've been watching these guys for 10 years, guys. 10 years I've been watching. Check that out again. Look at it. Look at that. Straight from the Maury facility. They've got them at these air bases. That's what these air bases are for. The Navy and the Air Force. They're cunts. They're doing it against you. They're trying to flood you out. They want to break your will and break your spirit. Because they couldn't do it through COVID. And we didn't take the vaccines. So now they're trying to flood us out. Look at that. Look at that. That is damning evidence. People's heads should be rolling for this. For the destruction and heartache they've caused. But you know what? Doesn't matter how many times you flood us out. It just makes us fucking stronger. Our community is getting stronger and stronger and stronger. And you know what? You fucking pedophiles are going to go to prison. Your day is going to come and we are going to be the ones that are going to round you up on the streets and you're going to get what you fucking deserve. If you want to follow my stuff, guys, jump onto innateawareness.com, www.innateawareness.com, or go to Nate Max Human Alliance on Telegram. I've been doing this shit for 10 years. I've got videos from 10 years ago. I was the first person in Australia to be doing videos on geoengineering and had all the morons ridiculing me for 10 years. Mainstream science now. Bill Gates and all the losers are doing it. The military is doing it. The Air Force are doing it. They do it around airports to stop it from hailing. Now we have all cloud seeding to muddy the water. Oh, it's just cloud seeding. Yes, we want to dim the atmosphere to stop the sun coming in so mould grows everywhere. And all the nanotechnology and shit they hide in the chemicals they're spraying on you activates because your immune system is so low because you haven't any sun for six months and the plants aren't growing. There's no photosynthesis. Human beings are like giant solar panels. We need the sun, guys. You need the sun. You need 1,400 lumens of light to go in your eyeballs every day to activate your DNA, to activate your soul codes. And what is this? The question is, what is this? Lucky we picked it up on infrared because you can't pick it up in the BOM. What is that? There in particular, I wouldn't be surprised as a fucking alien spaceship. That's the level of fuckery we're in at the moment. That's the level of shit we're in. We're living with half humans. We're living with people who want you dead. Agenda 21, all the politicians, all of them, all of them, scum. All the billionaires, scum. 40 million people die every year of starvation hunger and not one of these parasites does anything. All they do is hoard cash and use you as a commodity. They trade your birth certificate on a stock exchange. They claim your death certificate. They claim your insurance. It's a massive scam. COVID was a massive insurance scam and now... The next phase is food shortages. And why are we going to have food shortages? Because they are going to destroy the crops. They're going to wash all the topsoil out to sea. And they're going to blame Russia for it. When Russia is literally liberating the Ukrainian people who have been killed, bombed, shot and poisoned for the last eight years in the proxy war by their own government. 
but they don't tell you that on the news, do they? That's why you're on Telegram, that's why you're on Signal, that's why you don't watch the mainstream news, because you guys got a fucking brain. That's why. Check it out. You cannot make this shit up. The evidence is there and you cannot hide it. Let me get a ruler out. Oh, there we go. That's pretty straight. Yes, that's pretty good. Oh, yeah, well, yeah that's pretty good too. Yep, okay, a bit of, bit of pressure in here. Uh, a little bit there. Uh, that's a nice little curve. Probably is coming from here. It's hitting in, you know. Little curve in there. Straight edge. Let's just play origami, paper mache, and we'll just do this and keep the uh, weather forecast right in there. Yep, it's all natural though. Straight lines are natural now. You know, that's, it's a new phenomenon. So uh, NASA said that they're, they're natural. So just believe NASA, even though it means deception. So this is the floods, guys. Mullum's about to go under. Lismore is under, I heard. And it's just picked up just now. And this is the exact same storm. The exact same storm, the exact same way that happened three weeks ago. And they tried to wipe us out a week later and a week later, but we, we adopted something and we stopped it. And now they're hitting us on all angles. One, two, three, four. All the different systems. The Kempsey one, the Moree one, whatever the fuck is up here. You can see it. One, two, three, four, five. I don't know how many systems are hitting the northern New South Wales now, but we are under full on attack. This is literally ecological ecocide. It is genocide on the people, and they're trying to break the people from New northern New South Wales. And there goes the internet. This is Nate Max. Have a lovely night. The internet is out. That means the power is probably out. We've got floods tomorrow. I hope you guys are high and dry. Please ring your friends. Ring your family. It's time to evacuate. Get to high ground. Speak to you soon, beautiful people.